What is going on guys? It's Mark Draper here and I'm here with Ski Addiction and we're currently standing at the top of the Blackcomb XL Park. And then we're gonna do a park tour for you guys from smallest features to the biggest ones. So stick around and uh, check out what we got to show you. All right, so first to drop is gonna be this small jump here, just to the right of the bigger one at the top. So we'll do a little a demonstration of the feature. Come in. Nice feature to get warmed up on in the morning. We're just gonna keep on going. We got ourselves a little down to. Another nice feature to get warmed up on for the bigger features they got in this park. And then you can come into this DFD box. Next up here, we got a few rail options. Um, on the left side here, there's a Toberone feature. And on the other side, to the right, um, we got a little fun whale tail feature here that we're gonna do. We'll do it into the flat pontoon down there at the bottom. Kinda got like a nice little butter pad here. Super fun, super flowy. And we can come into this flat pontoon. Pop a little back 270 out. This is the Guru Park section. Starts off with a nice little elbow rail. Into a nice C. Then we got a nice A-frame feature here. And then we got a nice little dance floor box. Super fun little section there. There's some tabletop jumps in there as well. Um, we're gonna hit the tabletops for you guys in the little guru section. I'll wait my turn. I'll follow these snowboarders in. As long as I don't catch up. You know, I gotta warm up my 360s. Oh, I think someone went down. Oh, traffic. Just some nice little tabletops to warm up on. Then we're back into this dance floor box. A little bend here to bring you into that bottom rail section. So now we got two lines that lead you to the chairlift. It's gonna be a little bit easier than the left hand side. So we'll start off with this right hand side. We got this nice A-frame feature. Come into this nice fat tube. Into a nice cannon rail. And then into the fat pill. A little nose heavy there, but we made it through. And uh, we're off to the chairlift now for another lap. Oh, All right, so we're back at the top of the park and we're gonna do a tour through the rail line. Starts out with this nice down tube. Try a little two on. Comes into this flat bar. Try a little back 270 out. And then a nice teardrop feature. Just like that, top of the park rail line. We got a nice little side hit over here. It's here every year. And that brings you down into the next little rail section. We got a tow roam feature here. Just gonna do a nice straight slide on it. This rail is super sick. Nice DFD tube. Oh, fun. Oh, nope. Didn't lock onto that one. Now we'll go over to this other Toberone rail feature and uh, we'll see how it goes. You can also use that feature as a stall, which is super sweet. 
see if we can whip around a front four out of this guy. Yeah. Into the nice rainbow feature. I love doing backslides on the rainbow, so that's what we're gonna do. This is probably a medium to small for Black Park. So we'll we'll drop in here. This guy's going fast. We'll come in. Maybe we'll pop a little flat three for the little flat three there. Nice hip feature. And that brings us again into this bottom rail section. We'll do a little tour of the left side this time. I'm gonna hop this donkey kick because it's aggressive. Come into the down bar. Into the rainbow rail. And then this nice fat tube. And just like that, we're back off to the chair. All right, so we're back up at the top of the park and we're gonna hit the, uh, it would be a medium jump in Black Park, but some other parts probably a large jump. I'm gonna go for a cork three because I don't usually go corked enough on my cork three, so I always use this jump to warm up. Whoa. I don't know, you tell me if that was corked. Argue it in the comments. I never go corked enough. Which brings us into the next feature. This is a bit of a fun one and something I love about Wisp Parks. They're always changing stuff up. It doesn't stay the same the whole season. They just built this feature the other week. So a nice fun one. Jump up onto the pad. Hit the stall. Ooh. And then there's this two feature. A little fun playground there. Then we can come into the DFD still. Try to get a little fun swap on here. And then we are into the next section of rails. So there's kind of two lines, but you end on the S rail. You start off on the right line. So we'll come into this box. Nice mellow feature. That's what's also nice about Black Park is they do put some easier features in. Let's see if we can grease this ass rail first hit of the day. Oh! Almost. I don't know if I would count it, but we're back down to the main medium slash small section of the park. Oh, there's some new rails down in there. Um, we'll start off on the right rail line, do a little lip on. Give it a little 50 50. Not sure what this is. Oh, it's just a down rail. Woo. And we are back down to this bottom rail section. So we're going to go down to the left side of this rail line. First feature is the donkey dick. I like to ollie it because it's a little bit aggressive. Into the flat goal post. And the end of the park. And off to the chair for another lap. Bow. So we're back up at the top and we're gonna do a little transfer feature. Another thing I love about Black Park is there's lots of options and uh, different ways you can hit features. So we're gonna transfer from the small to the big jump. Take a little bit of extra speed. And just like that, transferred onto the big landing, a bit of a fun one. And we'll do this one again, because I was a little squirrely on the last one. So let's hope we don't go over the backside. Uh-oh. So luckily it's nice and groomed on the backside, so I didn't just get work. But uh, we'll go into the DFD feature again. Maybe we'll try a K-Fed for all you K-Fed lovers. 
There you go. That's a nice cave head for all you folks. And uh, we're gonna do the left line on this next rail section. Hopefully we can make the S rail all the way this time. But to start off this line is just this nice down rail. This rail's a little interesting, comes on from the side. Into the S rail. Woo! Bit too much lean there. And then we got one more rail line in this section. This section always gets a little bit busy. This left side is going to be a bit harder of a line than the right side. Um, so we got a double drop rail here, our art, and then we have an elbow feature, which I haven't hit yet. So first one's free, no judgment. This nice drop feature has a nice big lip onto it. Get up and over. All right, let's see if we got it. Oh, we kind of got it into the DFD. So that's going to be that middle small section of the park. Super fun, lots of different options you can do. Then you end up at the bottom rail line again. You know, we could try to spice things up on the right side, see what we can get going. What's going on, Tommy? We'll follow Tom, we'll do a little train. Train with the homies. Back three swap. Oh, a little sketchy, but we'll count it. <laughs> Boom! And back to the chairlift for another lap. I realize it's always super fun to end the run on. Then we'll redo this tow roam feature on the side. So another great thing about Black Park is they set up a lot of features for multi-purpose. So this tow roam feature, there's, you'll, you'll see the line of us hitting it, but this one we're going to go for a little stall. Just make sure we're not going to cut anybody off. You know, come up. Stall back down. You know, we'll cut back around for fun. Get the DFD. We did a K fed, so we'll go Brittany. And that leads us to the top of Gray Line. Also the large line. We got three booters on this line. Probably somewhere between 35 and 45 feet. All built super nice and super flowy. So we'll wait for our turn and then do a little example on these guys. We'll take our drop. Go for the core three. We'll come into the next jump. We go for a rodeo Ooh, or flat three. <laughs> Landy came up a little quicker there. And then this is nice. It's a nice little standing zone. You can rest up real quick before hitting the learner jump. Um, we call this learner because it's kind of built the same as the XL line. And you can practice your tricks and then take them onto the big jump. So we'll go for a switch trick off these guys. We'll go for a switch five. A little sketchy. Go for a nose butter three. And then you can always kind of poach this last feature. Don't cut anybody off. And we're back at the bottom of the park again on the way to the lift. Always check up hill in another fun lap. What's going on? This is the moment we've all been waiting for, and it's gonna be a tour through the XL line in Black Park, also known as Black Line. All these jumps are 60 feet plus. The speed's been changing a little bit all day, but we might still go for three here. Let's get after it. Put the three down. We got a nice little side hit feature here. Coming into a castle. And the last jump we have is Kong. Maybe 
missed the grab there, but count it still. And then we carve out to the bottom of the park. And that's going to be a tour of uh, Whistler Blackcomb's Black Park. Um, this is Mark Draper with Ski Addiction, and we're here to make you ski better.